this is the main interface of our simulator of GSM then I'll go to USSD here I have the link of my application and the app ID and the session that I've created now here I'll input a phone number for instance my phone number is 09 then I add the zero because the validation of phone numbers in this simula simulator asks for 11 characters and the service code is 963-hash then I click on next on send at this step I can create an account with common tracer create an account or 004 to exit so here it will be the continuation I add my name here so let me add a name like this my country name Democratic Republic of Congo Then my state of province, the city, Gomu. Enter the name of the currency, example USD for dollars. Here I can add CFD or francs. will search for a currency that correspond to this uh, to this keyword so it finds CFD and I choose one after that I can create my pin one two three four five then I re-enter my pin again Are you sure to create this account? And say yes. Yeah, the account is created successfully. Compose 963 hash to use it. Now I'll init a new connection. After creating an account, The money that I'll be getting is this, I can pay, I can go to my account, I can create a business with uh, GSM, my GSM. Now, um, to allow me to pay, to do payment, I will go, I'll be as an operator, I'll go to the admin, admin zone. Admin zone, now I have this Zeus to ask for an account. I can click on enable to enable this account so that they can start doing payment for instance if I want to pay I will get into pay it's continuation then I will enter the bill code the code that is uh, is uh, under the QR code that was generated by the seller so we are going to create a business and show how you can pay use you can create your business and sell using your application I'll rename it because here the process of paying the bill is intuitive I'll go create a new Yeah, now the first menu is payment and account after that to create business for account you can see your balance or send money to another phone number so I'll create a business um, continue. it is just like creating a business with an Android or any other platform but uh, 
with just the difference of platform. So the name of my business is, my, for instance, my harvest. It can be an agriculture that has produced its food and wants to put them on the platform. So your business is temporary or permanent. I can say it is uh, temporary. It is just for some days. Enter the number of days um, of days your company or business is available for today. So I can say my company will be my business will be available in 13 days. So I click on next and then enter the type of your business. Say farming, for instance, and till enter the type of business. Say farming. Yeah, it finds so it comes in French. Culture the plant. Then I'll choose this one. One. After that, describe what your company business does. So I can say. I have harvested my field, I'm very sorry for my English, and you can get them fresh from me, just that. After that, I say, are you sure? You want to add this business and say yes. Yeah, so business added successfully. Then after adding this business I will go once again back to the initiation now here you see the first menu has become sell not anymore pay as it was and account and my product has appeared so I go to my products so that I can add a product and here I have 0 over 3 so for GSM users they are just uh, allowed to use to, to put 3 products so you enter star for a new product or hash to go to home so I enter star after that I enter the product name for so this is banana And the description very fresh after that I enter the price of the product in USD so I can say my banana is uh, is uh, three dollars this is the currency that i chose while creating my account are you sure you want to add this product so yes and so on the product has been added so if i go back to the beginning again once again and I want to sell this time. Sell. Then here the code for banana is 80, uh, 48. So this is how I should end. I should sell star your phone number and star 
the code of this product and the quantity after seeing how the user can edit they can sell the product you can see how uh, to modify a product name or price when things have changed so you go just to the product for then you choose a product here I have just one I will choose one then here I can edit the name the price or the description or I can disable it online on Twitter app in the news feed so that it cannot be seen or I can even delete the the product yeah, so those are the possibility you can see just how to change the price you can enter the new price for instance you can yes, become 20 20 dollars are you sure to change Say yes so the product price has been updated successfully and all these information are also sent to the platform that and they can be seen by people using Android or any other device.